Welcome to Pippi's Place. Welcome back and uh, welcome to another video. And we're on a roll this week. <laughs> My last video we were trying uh, Mary's Gone Crackers and uh, tonight I'm trying something else we've never, I've never tried before. And uh, Little Son is taping for me tonight, so thank you, Little Son, for taping for Mama. You're welcome. <laughs> but look what we're trying tonight. Take a look at this. I bought a spaghetti squash. I mean, look at that. I've never tried spaghetti squash before. This is another thing that, as I was watching uh, Lean Secrets, uh, she's here on YouTube, that um, she made, you know, spaghetti squash. And pasta is another thing that I'm not really eating, um, well, not really, um, yeah, not really eating too much of uh, post-surgery. And so, and I miss it. I loved pasta. I loved Olive Garden and all that, although I've learned how to make new choices at Olive Garden. But anyway, uh, I miss, I do miss pasta. So I thought, well, what a way to um, go back and try pasta again without it being pasta, you know, being a, a, a good for you vegetable and all that. Spaghetti squash. So, um, while I was at HEB, I picked up a spaghetti squash, and it's actually called that. Just in case you've never had spaghetti squash either. I mean, here's the little thing. Here's the little, oh. whoops, there you go. Mm -hmm. So, it's actually called spaghetti squash. I'm not sure if that's clear or not. There we go. Spaghetti squash. See it right there? And so, anyway... And I think it was less than $2 for a spaghetti squat, I think, right? Let me mm -hmm. see. Uh, oh, yeah. Oh, well, I'll take that back. It was $2.70. <laughs> there you go. It was $2.79 for a spaghetti squash. So, anyway. Um, so, yeah, I just, I didn't put it on a, a pan or anything. I just, I rinsed off the outside and stuck the whole thing in the oven at three um, seventy-five, mm -hmm. And I left it for about 40 minutes. And took it out, cut it in half. There were some seeds in here. And um, so, so there are seeds that you have to remove that are kind of like in the center. And, and other than that, when you open, when you cut it open, I mean, it actually does look like spaghetti on the inside. How cool. This is hot. So I just not too long took it out. So when you take your fork, and there's a few seeds. I see I got to get out of there. And... I mean, wow, look at that. Oh. <laughs> spaghetti squash. We've never had spaghetti squash. I didn't grow up eating spaghetti squash. I'd never heard of spaghetti squash. So this is gonna be interesting. And I had some I had some pre-made spaghetti sauce in the refrigerator and I just mixed some Velveeta with it, <laughs> guys. And so because I just wanted to be able to try it, I kind of put it here on the side. So that's just Velveeta mixed with some you know, pre-made ragu, I think it is, or something. But anyway, spaghetti squash. And of course, you could always season it. I've got some. I use this a lot, uh, Mrs. Dash, because you know, of course, it has you know, it's salt free, and I, I like the taste of it myself. And they have, I don't know, a lot of different flavors and all that. But I actually do just like, you know, this. And so. Let's try some spaghetti squash for the very first time, I think, in my whole entire life. It's, it's got a little crunch to it, so I'm not sure if it's supposed to be a crunch or if I just didn't leave it in there long enough. Or, I guess it depends on how long you leave it, huh? Or if it's supposed to have a crunch or not, I'm not sure. But wow, I like it. Mm, mm, mm. Another winner for this week, guys. Oh my goodness, son, you want to try it? Sure. Let's see what little son thinks about it. <laughs> Let's see. Whoops. Good. Good. Yeah. It tastes like spaghetti. This was something added to it. Hmm. Yeah. Well, it really does. It has the texture and everything, you know, of uh, 
spaghetti and um, I don't know I kind of like I think I like the idea of it being a good for you vegetable mm -hmm. too something good for you that you know that you're eating uh, instead of um, pasta which we know pasta can bloat you and this and that and you know can have some adverse effects and stuff mm -hmm. but um, yeah so okay guys well that's we just came here to let you uh, be in on us trying spaghetti squash for the first time and I think we got another thumbs up. Um, I really liked it. All right. See you guys later. Bye.